Yo, what's up guys? Welcome back to another video and in this one we're gonna be showing you Well, I'm gonna be showing you how to um, get the headband on Anthony Davis. Uh, obviously There is no headband on Anthony Davis and I'm sorry about this video because Sadly, I recorded this video. I went to check and there was no audio so that sucks but I mean here we are and I guess we're just gonna have to voice over but um Quick question. Did y'all see the game winner last night or like two nights ago, three nights ago by Anthony Davis? Up Rondo, he puts it in. Here's Davis, 4-3 in the win. Oh, it's good! Anthony Davis has won it for the... Anyways, bro, that, that's just OP. A seven-footer shooting. Whatever. I, I think it's the headband that's giving him the powers, but... It's whatever, but um, as you can see here in the roster, if you scroll over to Anthony Davis, he has no headband in the picture, no headband in the other picture, no headband on the stats, no headband on the stats again. <laughs> Sorry, I'm having to commentate over what's already been done. But um, it's actually really simple. All you're going to want to do to get the headband on him is go to create a player. As you can see, I already tried this before this just to test it out. Um, once you created the player, you're going to want to go scroll down um, – well, actually, you're going to want to put a headband on him first. Click Accessories. Put the headband. It should be right there. After you do that, you're going to want to scroll down all the way to Import Player DNA. This is when you obviously use an NBA player to take their DNA and import it into the created ugly player. So go down to the Lakers. You're going to want to go down one time and then Import Anthony Davis. Now, you could import appearance without the attributes, or you could import the attributes without the appearance. You're going to want to import either one of the first two because that imports the appearance. I recommend doing the one all the way on the top so you get the attributes with it, and you don't have to go back and correct all those. You can obviously raise them if you want, but I recommend just go ahead and putting them all in. Now, as you can see, he has all the crew stuff on. What you're going to want to do is go up to shoes and gear, or accessory that doesn't matter which one as you can see on accessories there is a red section as long as there's a red section so it's really simple you just go down to the red section um, and once you're down to the red section you just want to go over one time and there as you can see the headband is on them it's black uh, the jersey's red 2k colors it's because it's the crew colors you know once you get in game with Anthony Davis it'll be Lakers colors and the headband will be all fine and stuff and it's really that simple um, as you can see everything's the same you can raise his attributes if you want after this go down to export player DNA it's different from import because this is when you're putting it um, go ahead and like adding it to your roster and stuff and not like importing someone's DNA into him so I'm going to go ahead and save and share the DNA just in case, you know, people feel like using Anthony Davis. Here I realize that I don't need to use my controller because I'm on PC and just went in and typed his name out. Um, I think right there I struggled to find the parentheses sign because it uh, turns out 60% keyboard is, has nothing on it. But um, we'll wait for my slow, slow, slow self. Um, go ahead and add him to your roster and then after you add him to your roster it's really super simple obviously like I feel like any decent mind a, per a person that plays 2k would do this you know you, you go to create a roster and then after you go to create a roster you can either go to your roster which mine is titled real because I have all the um, like all the players that have messed up stats and how bad 2k21 is as people are saying you know um, I went ahead and like updated people's stats that I think. As you can see, they're both 99s. That doesn't mean that I just made them 99s. Like, like I raised LeBron's three probably to like a 91 or something. I made Duncan Robinson's three like a 95 or something because he's shooting amazing. I made Tyler Hero's three higher. You know, just stuff like that. Bam, out of bio faster. Um, once you go to Anthony Davis, you're going to want to delete him from your roster and then go all the way to your created players and you can import them. For some reason, it showed four for me. It might show two per person for you, but... Um, anyways, it's that simple. I hope you guys enjoyed, and I will see you in the next one. Peace out.